Okay, so it's me and Happy Jack picking up a free snake. Towing a vehicle. And hanging out with, with Abbott and Costello. Yeah. So somehow we got to pick up a fish tank in one town, pick up a stand in another town, but before we go to the next town, we have to tow this guy's car, and then we're all going to go, all right, is that the story? Yeah. So, but it's a nice tank. Is this the city guy now? Think we'll ride in the van. <laughs> oh, let the fun begin. Let the fun, fun begin. Okay. So, we're getting ready to go to our next destination. This turned out to be a pretty fun day. Mm -hmm. We've only been doing it for like five hours. So, and we don't think the stand's going to fit, so we're going to take that apart. Maybe. Yeah, well, probably. And, uh, yeah. Junior got his first real full taste of inner city people. <laughs> I'm surprised he's even strapping the car down. We have reached a second location. This guy's watering his plants for a while. We are now in Howard Beach. Dead end. Dead end. There's water right there. That's a place to leave your boat trailer. It was on the guardrail. Oh, there's a hole. Okay, guys. There it is. That's a 210 gallon tank. Uh, less than two years old. Two filters. All the hoses, no stand. Um, we were going to get the stand, but that turned into way big of an ordeal. Three hours worth of hell. Needless to say, the stand stayed there. Um, originally, when he bought this, it was supposed to be the tank only. And Junior got them down on price, got them to throw on the filters, all the hoses, and that stand, but the stand wasn't worth it. Um, so, like I said, it's a nice piece. Uh, you can see, as you can see right through it, there's no scum line on it. It is less than two years old. And, uh, 210 gallons of Big Mama. That's uh, six feet long, two feet depth, front to rear, and I think 30 inches tall. Oh, 125, if you want to compare it comes up to like here okay and it's six inches narrow um it's still in the car because me and him couldn't get it out i wasn't strong enough he could have did his end um it really takes three people to carry it so we were able to get it out from where it was it was four of us but three of us started i had one end and two guys had the other because we had to go through a doorway but when it came time to get it out of the van just me and him was not going to work so basically what we're going to do is I don't have it here I have it at the storage unit we got a piece of plywood the same size as this from the top of the stand and I'm going to get two uh, dollies I'm going to screw them together we're going to take this put them on the dollies on the stand and roll in the back of the storage unit so this will be the new tank when he moves this will replace the 125. So, that's a nice piece. That's a nice piece. That's moving up in the world if you hit the fish tanks. So, I'm sorry I didn't record more. Um, it was definitely an experience today. They, they were two partners, meeting business partners, two totally different ends of Queens one shore to the other shore two totally different lifestyles meaning uh, housing and two to totally different personalities totally different personalities 
and uh, it's always enjoyable dealing with inner city people so we had a good time just got very long um, to drive there get this tank and drive back it was six and a half hours and that only took us um, 40 minutes to get there and about 15 minutes to get home the rest of the time was spent digging around and waiting yeah for cars to be towed things to be moved oh my god oh my god I, the, the left only lasted so long near the end it was, there was no more left to left but they were nice people so um with that said that's about it if you ever do buy a tank and you buy one used always look at the silicone look at the edge of the silicone because every time you clean the tank you hit the silicone if the silicone is a perfectly crisp straight line on all your corners it's not an old tank even though the dates are on the bottom of them so and the silicone isn't discolored from all sorts of chemicals 